What's good planet Earth? Welcome back to the channel. My name's Charlie and thank you for coming along for another video. Today I'm here again with my lovely daughter Sophia. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to be going through a few tracks on the Hit Me Hard and Soft album from Billie Eilish. So today we're going to be doing another double reaction and we're going to be getting into which tracks? Chihiro and Wildflower. Wildflower is like my personal favourite. Is it? That's your first one of the whole so album? Good. Yeah? yeah? Dope. Okay, good. So today's going to be a good one. Right, so Chihiro and Wildflower. If you're, if you're new to the channel, I hope you enjoy the video. And if you do, then please think about sticking around and hitting that subscribe button. If you want access to the rest of the channel and the content not found on YouTube, Patreon is in the description. If you want to make a one-off donation to ensure that your request gets done, PayPal is down in the description as well, guys. But let's get into it. Without further ado, let's go. Just don't let it fall through. Just wait. Oh. Even that whoop. Yeah. It's mixed so well. We have to wait until the end because the end is like. Yeah, sublime. Beautiful. <laughs> cool. To take my love away. When I come back around, well, I know what to say. Said you won't forget my name. That bass is incredible. That was amazing. It just like broke out into such a bigger sound. Right I know. There. That was great. The, the the track on this is so well mixed. The bass sounds like real thumpy, doesn't yeah. it? It's amazing. And to have that much noise going on with the music and for the for the vocals not to get lost is amazing. Whoever produced this. It's her brother. Is it? Yeah. Damn. They do it all like together. What a, an amazing duo yeah <laughs> that is incredible they do everything together. do they yeah like everything how didn't i know that wow that's so impressive how old's uh, her brother is he younger he's no he's like i think four years older okay still yeah or something like that like a few years older man yeah people he's, are mad he's talented. so good yeah he's so good i could tell i mean the proof's in the pudding right damn <laughs>
that was sick. This is a masterpiece. The whole album, so I've only heard three tracks so far, but it's so good. So that was amazing where they sucked like all of, you know where... Yeah, like, it like went silent yeah. for a second. It was like deathly silent. It's like they turned the silence up. I've never heard silence so silent. <laughs> <laughs> but that was amazing. Like it's such a dynamic sound. They've gone from like bringing it in. It's almost like a club track, isn't it? Like a mm. room to club track, a bit housey, just like yeah. a driving, thumping beat. Then it all hell broke loose there, or all heaven broke loose, should we say? Um, <laughs> <laughs> and then he just sucked it all out, so you got like a real dynamic sound with like. And then it's like. Yeah, just nothing, and then just, <laughs> and then just brings back the bass in, yeah. so like emphasise just certain bits. It's so clever. I'm well Still impressed. Still got three whole minutes. I know. <laughs> Good. It's worth it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh. oh, so good. So, like, we're really just seeing here, aren't we, that she's she's not like a one lane artist. She's a multifaceted artist. In three tracks, she's been like, "Yeah, I can do this, but check this out. <laughs> I can do this too." And then she's like, "Yeah, yeah, but check check this out. I can do <laughs> exactly. this as well." It's exactly. like it's amazing. Like I've never heard such variety over th the first three tracks. Yeah. Of, of, I don't know, maybe any album that I've ever heard. Really? Yeah, it's amazing. She's a proper artist, isn't she? Yeah. Cool. Okay, right. Well, Wildflower next, huh? Oh, okay. So excited. Yeah? Yeah. This is your favourite of the album? I think so. <laughs> I don't know. My f I remember when I was listening to this for the first time, my uh -huh. friend was trying to talk to me and I was, well, I was listening to this, I'd never heard it before. My friend was trying to talk to me because she wanted to see my reaction. Mm -hmm. Um, and she was just like talking, and I was like, "Just, just wait a second. <laughs> I'm obsessed with this." Yeah, yeah. Just wait. Just, just give me a second. <laughs> I need to listen to this. You're about to find out. Yeah. <laughs> right. Well, I'm about to find out. So let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Do you know what that guitar reminds me of? Straight out of the gate. 
is you might not know this it's a real old r&b song it's a uh, 3lw no more i'll play it to you later because mm-hmm. you'll know exactly what i'm talking about <laughs> it's lovely start again Basically, in this part, you can there's this whole part, and then you can hear her singing in the background. Right. That is like the best part. Yeah. Yeah. Sad. Also, I forgot to mention we're not doing this in order. I've basically just picked out six songs <laughs> that are like my favourites. So we're not, yeah. that's why we're not doing it in order. Anyway. That's cool. Yeah, and it's also like it's they've managed to mix it so that the voice is like up here. Yeah. It's like it's behind you. And they've panned it as well. So they've put like one part in this more in this headphone mm. and another here. And it gives you this really nice movement, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah. Like also, in the I background. That I, something that I've noticed is that um a lot a lot of like how do I say this? <laughs> in a lot of parts of all these songs, yeah. you can there's just loud music but you can sort of like hear a, like a bit of her singing yeah in the background yeah it's really clever isn't it yeah like it's got this nice sort of dreamy track and yeah as you say and then you just, you hear just her put like, it like here yeah yeah it's yes. amazing do you see her in the back of your mind in my Wow, <laughs> that is an amazing track. This is 
it's so cool. It's like, where are we going now? That is amazing. Yeah. So one thing I'm not very good at is listening, because I, uh, you might be the same as me, I try and listen to the, the music and I'm not very good at like concentrating on that and the lyrics. Mm. So but what, from what I can pick up, she's talking about like possibly a love lost, someone that she used to be with and now is with someone else. So it seemed, it seemed like she was like em envisioning her old boyfriend with this new girl questioning like, can't stop thinking about her like a burning like fever yes. um and so I, I found it was very sort of like appropriate for that sort of feeling there was a lot of drawn out sung notes that sounded like almost like pain do you know what i mean yeah. like singing these drawn out whaley kind of yeah. notes do you know this, what i mean this is i think this is like the only time that i'll tolerate people singing about their ex-boyfriend yeah <laughs> yeah well it's it's done tastefully isn't it and yeah, it's also it's not tasteful. it's very mature the way that she speaks about it she's not just slandering um her exes and yeah. just like going in on them she's got a really sort of grown-up perspective on it yeah. just like i was in the hotel room crying but i know you didn't mean to hurt me so i kept it to myself I love that. do you know what i mean yeah. like that's a that's a you could argue that's not a um, a healthy way to do it but 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 also you know we don't know what exactly what she's talking about it could be that she realized that he hadn't actually done anything wrong if he had then obviously you should say something but whatever either way she isn't being like well f you do you know what i mean <laughs> which which definitely isn't a mature way to to say it so i agree with you speaking about your exes and stuff if you're going to do it in such a beautiful insightful way I'm here for it. Yeah. That was amazing. Amazing. Wow. Usually I do an introduction to the afterthought, but we just went straight into it. But never mind. <laughs> it's all good. I hope you've enjoyed this video, guys. We've definitely enjoyed it. Definitely. I have definitely enjoyed it. <laughs> I am blown away by how good this project is. I really am. Like, I, as I say, I knew she was good, but I didn't know she was this good. <laughs> I really don't. I, and I don't know why she isn't more pop. Well, maybe she isn't. I don't know everyone my age. But she's she's definitely popular with young people, right? Yeah. Like like people your age, and but she she could keep up with anyone, a, any of the older lot for sure. Mm. She's she's wise way beyond her years. Yeah, definitely. That's exactly what I think. Yeah, and super articulate as well. You yeah. Know, she's really good at telling you exactly how she feels in a really like artistic way. Yeah. It's amazing. Here for it. Anyway. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll catch you in the next one. And as always, be kind to yourselves, love everyone, and take care. I freaking love you guys. Bye. <laughs> Bye.